HBO show, and he said, and I quote, I, I say, what I say during the press conferences is 90% opposite of what I think. So, so basically what he was saying, if a receiver is great or if, if a cornerback is great, he actually means he sucks and he's going at him all game long. Why are you buying into what Tom Brady is like is saying, or is he saying opposite of what we want him to think? I it's so confusing, honestly. Like, <laughs> I want to say that you know he's lying, but at the same time, wouldn't that kind of explain his mindset being different than everybody else's? I mean, think about it. This guy's mindset is unlike any other in sports. It's ridiculous. So. Is that the key to it? I mean, I, I have no clue. There's something here. And like I said, I don't know if he's lying. I don't know if he's telling the truth. I don't know what to think because it's Tom Brady. Like at the end of the day, if I found out he was lying, whatever. If at the end of the day, if I found out it was true, I wouldn't be that surprised, honestly. <laughs> I mean, the guy is just different in the yeah. way he plays football, in the way he prepares, in the way he, you know, trains his body. I mean, the guy is just different he's a different breed so no honestly it wouldn't surprise me if he's got some kind of a mental warfare it's the same thing michael jordan used to do michael jordan used to make up stories in his head about other players doing stuff and then turn around and 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 go crazy on them like clyde drexler with the trailblazers he said that clyde said something like you know this is my league to him or something like that and you know, he said that he Mike came out and said that he said that and he played great and all this stuff. And then at the end of the finals, Mike came out and was like, yeah, no, he never said that. I just did that to pump myself and the rest of my teammates up, like just did it. Like, I'm sure there's something going on in Tom Brady's brain where he just does things different than everybody else. He's got to. It's how he's Tom Brady. So, no, honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if this was true. Tori, what are your thoughts on that? Like, are we seeing a new Tom Brady and are, are you buying into what, what he's telling us here? Uh, I don't know. Tom Brady is Tom Brady. I don't I don't put a lot of stock into it. At this point, he's saying he's great, but he sucks, but he really thinks he's great. Like, it's just nothing but a mind game right now with Brady. And <laughs> he's if you ask me, it's like it's like going away from home for the first time and being away from your parents. You get a little wild, you get a little crazy, you got that little bit of freedom because he doesn't have Belichick there anymore. Are you saying he's living his college life? <laughs> I, I, I thoroughly believe he is living his college life right now. He is, he is. His parents got him a credit card. He's racking up debt, and then he's like, "How come I can't buy lunch?" Yeah, I, mean, I don't. I don't think Tom Brady's ever going to have to worry about buying lunch. Yeah, by he, the way, Paul, so. he has like a supermodel <laughs> wife that makes more money than he does, or something like that. So yeah, I'm, right. I'm sure they're doing fine. And I'm, fine I'm, I'm sure they're okay. Yeah. 